Okay, so if you have a duplicator uh, i3 Plus or the uh, you know, Monoprice Maker Select uh, Plus and you're having problems where um, if you home all the, ax all the axes and uh, it's not right, it's hovering over the screw, uh, what you need to do is adjust um, the stop switch. So uh, I have it homed already, but if you didn't, you would go to uh, you go to System Home X Y Z, and uh, that'll put it in the home position. And you can see there it's homed. Now what happens is uh, sometimes when it comes out of the box and it homes. It, uh, it doesn't home correctly. Um, the stop switch is at an angle, and I'll show you that. What happens is, is the extruder head ends up touching the screw. So uh, I'll show you how to fix that because it was a little confusing for me to figure out. So if you move the, the back of the uh, bed plate forward here, You'll see that there's this uh, stop switch. Let me zoom in on it here. And uh, that little switch is what controls um, when the bed plate decides to stop. So right now, uh, let me see if I can show this here. right now you can see that it's on there pretty straight uh, but what happens is that sometimes these uh, allen screws get loose and this is crooked uh, and it's crooked back just a little bit so I'll loosen it here and, and show you so I've loosened it here and you can see that this kind of moves. Right now it's angled. And now it's straight. That little bit uh, of difference is going to change when the uh, bed plate stops and it moves back and it's going to screw up how your printer homes. So if you get it out of the box and it kind of looks crooked like this, you want to make sure that you have it you know, forward and uh, tighten the screws down. And then when you go back and home the printer, uh, it should be in the right spot now and it should not be touching Touching the screw, it should be right at the edge of the bed plate there.